Hey guys, Ron here from My Hero Design. One of the things I like to do with my videos is to add a color background to my videos, especially if they have a whiteboard, for example. I may want to have a blue background or a red background. The way to do this now in Explainedio is to upload a colored PNG or SWF, whatever image file in the background here and that's basically how it's done and after that if you want to change the color you have to create a new file and upload it so what I've done is I've created a background file that I hope makes it easier to uh, set up some color backgrounds and I've also added in uh, just a couple little enhancements as well let me show you what I mean I'm going to go here to the first slide and just show you what I have here. I've got a little story being told. Okay, I've got some bullet points and then a sign off slide here. And I want to add a background so that this is a little more interesting. Okay, so I'm going to go to Open Canvas and I'm going to go to Add Animation Slide, Add Flash Animation. I'm going to navigate to MHD background dot SWF okay and just double click make sure that don't sketch is checked and click add once that's done make sure to click scale full screen the last thing you want to do now is move this object to the front of the scene you're working on okay this is only a one frame object so it'll show up pretty much instantly and now you'll see when I close the canvas that I have a cool background in place okay so now I've already got something interesting but it doesn't stop there of course um, I'm going to go back to the first object here, which is the background. Click Customize This Animation. You'll see that we have three outline areas. Okay, the first one is the main color of the right side here. I'm going to show you this second one is a shine effect in the middle. And this last one is a second object which you can get rid of. So when I first created this, I just wanted to be able to quickly choose a new color for my background and not have to worry about re-uploading a million different you know, background files. So here already we have a whole new video with a cool background and you can just add in this file for every scene that you create that you want a new background. Okay, now while I was working on this, I said, well, why not, while I'm at it, add a cool little shine effect to make things even more interesting. So if you want that, you just turn it on. So you can choose your color here, and you'll have the shine effect for number two here. Okay, so if we preview the scene, again, we have a really cool professional background with a gradient, little shine effect there. Okay, and the last thing I did was I said, well, why don't we add like a, another layer basically that we can turn on and off. So I added this. Now the cool thing here is that you can reduce the opacity. And the more you reduce the opacity, the closer you'll get to the color underneath. So if you just want to have variations of a shade, and I'll turn off the shine for now, you'll see that you can create really cool effects. just by selecting one color. So if I change the color here, this is just gonna be a darker version. So now if I just wanna change this one color, you have a cool darker shade here immediately. And then if you wanna get even crazier, you can just change this color and bring the opacity back up. 
Okay, so you bring this back up to one, and now you have a two color background of whatever you like. Okay, and there you've created a new background for your video without going into some image editor and having to try to create this on your own. Uh, you can just go in and edit it very quickly just by clicking customize this animation and messing around with all of these. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Uh, this is a freebie for uh, for my customers and I'm going to put it up in the Facebook group as well. And uh, I hope you enjoy it, get some good use out of it. And if you have ideas for upgrades to this, just shoot me an email at support at myherodesign.com.